Welcome to Raymond James Stadium. This year, the Buccaneers have struggled to one victory, but a winning team does call this place home. Today, USF looks for a signature victory in its young program's history. The Bulls face number 17 Miami in front of a sellout crowd here in Tampa. Well, Miami will start out of the eye, Ja'Cory Harris. Fakes the running play and goes to Hankerson, his favorite receiver. He'll pick up about 10 yards. He's wearing 10, not his familiar number 95. He is the guy who applies all kinds of pressure, even against double and triple teams. On third and 10, complete pass, enough for the first down. Good throw by Harris to Leron Bird, who grabs his freshman. You're going to find some stuff happening to you you didn't expect. Harris down the middle, another perfect throw and another first down for Miami. Beautiful strike to his tight end, Tavares Johnson. A gain of 29, and they will go for it on fourth and inches, a tight formation. And Damian Berry, number 20, is the new tailback for the first time. Berry, first down and more. Cuts it outside, Berry at the 11 and then pushed back, but he has the first down. That's the second tight end. Ja'Cory Harris on a half roll. Throws for the end zone. Hankerson bobbled that ball. The official, I don't think, saw him juggling. They will take a look at this one. Daniels tries to run. Caught from behind and dropped. Andrew Smith, the 6'2 sophomore. Draw play. Cooper gets enough for the first down. And not got a on him. New tailback, Damian Berry. And he refuses to go down. Berry just dragging tacklers with him inside the 40. Daniels takes off. Had the ball ripped away. Daryl Sharpton ripped it out of there, and Miami has it. Boy, Sharpton made no bones about it. He wasn't going for the tackle. He just reached in and ripped the ball out, and Randy Phillips made the recovery. Mark, I'd have thought the other thing would have happened today. I'm right with you, but it's not that way. And the tailback, Javaris James, untouched down to the five. Not a mountain. In-state rival, they lead 7-0. And James goes in virtually untouched as Miami is just destroying the defense of the USF Bulls. James of Miami still with a chance with a 10-win season. And a really good ball game are up by two touchdowns. First all the way to its own 15-yard line. Damian Barry didn't stop till he lost his footing outside the 30-yard line. Chris Ross hit only two of his last seven, though. Corner blitz coming. Harris throws over the middle, and he's got the first down to his fullback, Mike James. But even Hankerson's really standing out. Harris double clutches, throws, got the first down. Johnson got it that time. Toss sweep, Damian Barry. And they're just eating up this defense. Gain of 17 on that one. And Nate with his off. Javaris James, touchdown. Wasn't touched in the lead. was two yards in the end zone. They're better than this. Yep. Lamar Daniels takes the ball out and can't get away from the safety. Vaughn Telemac came up from his free safety spot, had him around the ankle and just wouldn't let him go. Daniels intercepted. Picked off by Brandon Harris. The ninth pick of the year by Daniels and the third that Harris has swiped. Now third and five. Daniels flushed out of the pocket and they got him. 
Back at the 45-yard line, the sack will go to Sean Spence, who had missed three straight games with an injury. Comes in on the blitz, picked up his fourth sack of the season. Bulls with nine guys for the line of scrimmage. Put a lot of pressure on, did not get there. Bosher with a sky-high punt that allowed great coverage and a tackle at the 10. And it was Corey Nelms downfield and also Colin McCarthy. They'll start this time from their 12. Plancher. Boy, he'll lose a couple. Miami. Not themselves well. Yes. Draw play. Damian Barry. First down and more. Gain of 17 for the converted safety. Saw his very, very quietly has had seven carries for 80 yards in this game. Randall Washington, that is a big freshman, isn't he? 6'4, mm. 330. Good protection here. Pass down the middle. Touchdown! And a flag at the end of it. Diedrich Epps. Two receivers right together. Three defenders in there as well. And Epps was the guy who came up with the ball for a touchdown. Diedrich Epps, you know, there's a lot of pressure put down the middle of the football field. I'm not sure this is a is the proper route. Uh, somebody ran the wrong one, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, you don't put two receivers in there. But the tight end was the intended receiver from Ja'Cory Harris. And you're right, Mike, his, his shoulder obviously is okay. And it's all set up because of the running game. Damian Berry just had that big run and that offensive line up there doing their job. Daniels under pressure. McCarthy got him for the sack back at the 15. Colin McCarthy, who leads this team in tackles on the season, came off. Miami with Cooper. Roaring over midfield, finally taken down by Nate Allen as he got to the 45-yard line. Screen. Cooper. 23-yard line. Still on the ground. Cooper, 10, first down and more. And about the eight-yard line. You know, this game has really turned on the fact that coming out, a little, little, little bit extra room for it to move on in there. Well, we're out to 32 yards now. They actually get the play off. And Bosher knocks it through. So Miami now up 31 to 10 with 9.44 to go.